Hey guys, it's John Howell here from officialjohnhow.com and in this podcast, we are going to talk about the foundation to your success when it comes to trading. So let's get straight into it. Okay, this is something that a lot of traders just don't get. Let me fix this camera up here. Um, this is a thing that this is something. This is a thing that most traders don't get, and you may be missing this as well too when it comes to trying to get ahead in the markets. There is a thing called the foundation to your success when it comes to trading. Now, if you think about this for a minute, if you're in a situation where you're trying to build a house. Do you build it on sand or do you have do you take the time to lay the foundation first? Well, obviously you, you know what the answer is, right? You'll make the, you lay the foundation first. Well, I find that is so true when it comes to traders in the market. And, uh, and, and the thing is, let me, just, let me just check that my camera is working there. Cool. Um, and, the tr- and the truth is this, is that there is a foundation to your success when it comes to trading. And now we're not talking about a trading system. We're not talking about back testing. We're not talking about trading live. We're not talking about charting, tech and charting analysis and all that sort of stuff. No, it's called the mindset, but it's much deeper. The foundation to your success goes to a wide range. There's a lot of things that goes into your foundation to success. But one of the biggest things that's going to get you uh, really successful in the market is one key ingredient is your ability to 100% focused on what the market is telling you at the time. Makes sense? So this is just one of the key ingredients. So you've, got, you've got a whole bunch of other areas of key ingredients and stuff like that. As I go through these podcasts, I'll bring them up. But one main key ingredient is really important for you to be successful is to, be, is to have the ability to be 100% focused and 100% calm in yourself with what is happening in the market or on the chart at that time. That's why if you're trading a Forex or any mini futures or anything like that, intraday trading, and you're in front of the charts for a long time, you're likely to make mistakes. The reason why is because you're in front of the charts for a long time. And it's very easy to make mistakes because it's very easy not to be 100% focused on what the chart is telling you or what the market is telling you. And so therefore you rush, you make mistakes, you get in when you shouldn't, you get out when you shouldn't, and all these things happen. That's the reason why for me personally, I've now 10 years of trading, I now personally trade just a daily chart where I trade maybe an hour or two per day and that's it. Therefore, I make less mistakes. Right now, I'm getting over 90% success rate and I'm doing very well in my trading and I have done for a long time now. So, but the thing is, is that if you're trading a long time with trading, like if you're trading like four, five, six, seven hours per day, trading the, trading the say the Forex market, the Forex market is huge. People like the Forex market. They think you can trade small, make, you know, trade a small amount of money and make a lot of money, money. and which is true, but unfortunately it doesn't happen that way. And so, one of your foundations to your your foundation to your success one of the key ingredients to your success is your ability to focus be a hundred percent focused uh with what the market is telling you and unfortunately for most of us we have so much going in our brains that we're thinking about the bill we're thinking about what's actually happening that day we're thinking about uh, you know, I missed that trade yesterday, I'm gonna try and revenge trade, or I've gotta get back in the market. And all these things are happening in outside our brains, right? Maybe the kids got a cranky, you know, all this sort of stuff. There's so many things that's happening inside our brain that when you're looking at the charge, you've got all these things going on, you're not 100% focused. And if you're not, you're gonna continue making mistakes. So here's a quick drill that I want you to do to see how your focus really is. And uh, this is, I'm gonna give you a drill to see how it is, and then I'm gonna give you a drill to show you exactly how I get myself 100% focused with what with, with myself. So the first thing is that I want you to close your eyes. Okay, I want you to close your eyes. And I want you to picture a shot clock, you know, the shot clock when you've got a, uh, you know, the basketball. Okay, so close your eyes, picture a shot clock. And what I want you to do now is I want you to picture that, and picture that, you know, you've got the shot clock, you've got the ring, you've got the, you know, you've got the, uh, You've got the um, the the countdown from um, the countdown behind it, and it's at ten seconds. And now it's and now close your eyes and picture that ten seconds on that shot clock. And then nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. 
Now, you probably saw that happening while I was counting down because I was guiding you through that, right? But the question you've got to ask yourself, what I want you to do is after, after listening to this podcast, what I want you to do is I want you to stop and look at that, look at that, stop and do it again while there's silence, while there's no noise, no music, no nothing. Stop and do it again and see how far you get through. Generally, your market get, generally the, the count, the, the shot clock goes from around about 10 seconds down to maybe six, maybe five before another thought comes banging in. The most successful traders on the planet have the ability to stay 100% focused. Now, that, now, just because you don't have focus doesn't mean you can't get it. And this is how you get it. You need to be able to calm your mind and get yourself into a place of, of 100% focus. And this is a, and everything's a trained muscle here, okay? So how do you train that? Well, meditation. I know it might sound weird, and visualization. And I have found this to be so helpful and I have found this to be so helpful in my trading because it's a double it's a, it's a double edged good sword, right? Because one side of the edge of the sword is you're visualizing, and what you could be visualizing is on the exact perfect setup you're looking for, right? So now your brain's going over and over and over and over and over and over again that when you sit on the charts, you're likely to take action. Now on the other side of it, you're training your brain to be focused, and so when you're doing that and you're holding that thought in your mind. You might hold that thought in your mind for five seconds, and another thought comes in, and then you push it aside. And you might hold it for another five seconds, another thought comes in, and you push it aside. And now you might hold it for 10 seconds, you know what I mean? And then you push it aside, and you're, and you're, and you're, and you're training the brain to be 100% focused on that one thing at that one time to really maximize it. Really successful people have the ability to have a lot of things going on, but when they're focused, but when they're doing one thing, they're doing one thing. Now, they might do that one thing for an hour and they're 100% focused on that. Then the next hour, they're 100% focused on something else. That's what successful people have the ability, whether it's a sports player, whether it's a business person, or even an investor. That's what they do. Plus, they have a checklist and so on and so forth. But the foundation to your success in the markets and trading is your ability to focus. And if you can't focus, then you need to start setting some things up where, you, where, where you're refreshing yourself and you get yourself refocused all the time. Make sense? And that's why it's so hard for individuals to make money with intraday trading because you need to stay focused all the time. So try that. I want you to, I try that and I challenge you to, to start implementing this into whatever system you're using. And if you're using a system that you know without a doubt works, then cool, keep using it. If not, then head on down to my website, official.com, or there's obviously a link on this page here. You know, I'm giving away a free uh, training event right now, of course, stuff like that to really help you out moving forward. If you want to get my help, I'm doing some coaching as well too. So you can you can move forward with that. So anyway, guys, I'm out of here. Remember, success can be yours if you go claim it. So step up, take massive action, and face your fears today. <laughs>